Hello everyone and welcome back to another video and today the Q vendor leader Ben Bowler has finally surrendered but what is but because the title is the Q vendor leader has finally surrendered but so I'm going to tell you that that in a minute or later in this video so first off Let's talk about the past, okay? So finally, the key vendor leader, Ben Bowler, surrendered, and then we started to talk about the past and that um, back in August 2020, because this was back in August 2020. So, so I was like joking around with Ben on a round on Xbox and stuff. And, you know, I've been doing that back in 2017 i believe yeah because i i kept because i kept joking around with him and you know and then all of a sudden he just overreacts and overreacts so yeah and then definitely this was something i really didn't want to do so yeah when me and kieran were um having a joke around with ben so yeah and ben had to go so I said goodbye, Ben, or you. I don't. I don't know because I, I was kind of being a nutter to him though. Because I can be a nutter sometimes. But yeah, and then before Ben left the party on Xbox, he said to me and Kieran, "Shut up, you. I don't know, gangster something." And then me and Kieran both started to overreact. And then I decided to make a video. Benjamin Bowler died, which I was actually joking with him though, but he should learn to take jokes, obviously. So yeah, now back now, back to August 2020. Well, speaking of August 2020, so what happened back in that time? So yeah, I've been joking around with Ben as well, and so was Kieran. And then Kieran ended up telling me to um, take a picture of Ben's face and put it on Messenger or whatever. And then all of a sudden, Ben started overreacting as well. And also somebody reported him to Xbox. I don't know who it, it was. It wasn't me or Kieran. It was just some random person. And all of a sudden, Ben started overreacting on who it was. He thought it was me reporting him on Xbox. And then all of a sudden, his parents and that were thinking, was saying what's going on Ben and then Ben didn't really want to talk about it and then they said to him if you do not tell us we are going to cancel your subscription and so Ben just went the fuck ahead and just told them about it okay they we're talking about me and talking about Kieran and this is something you won't believe okay something that you will never believe definitely so I allowed Ben's mum to come and talk to me, well, try and talk to me, and I, and I told her, and I explained everything, what was going on, okay? So I said that Kieran has been getting me to try and piss off Ben because he has been bossing me around and stuff, which is actually true, which I am telling the truth. You might think I'm lying, but you're actually wrong, obviously. So, yeah, and then, she's, and then Ben's mum said... Okay, I will speak to Kieran's mum if I have to. And, you know, and then Ben and I were, like, thinking, please don't, because it's gonna, actually going to make it worse. But, but suddenly, it did get worse. Clearly, got worse. Wasn't my fault. And then, all of a sudden, when Kieran heard all about this, yeah, then Kieran ended up saying sorry to Ben... And regretting it to Ben. And then he said, don't worry about Mark. He's just being horrible. And I was like, what? Yeah, Ben told me all about it. So I went ahead and blocked Kieran for that. Okay. And then a couple of days later, after I blocked him. Yeah, Kieran decided he wanted to get Lewis to try and get me. And so Lewis did. So well, what Kieran said to Lewis, hey, Lewis, can you get Mark for me? And then, yeah, and then I joined the party, and then I ended up saying, oh, look, it's the traitor. And then, you know, and then Kieran said, "You want, we want to discuss the deal not to make more videos on each other. Well, 
this would depend, okay? This is depending on Kieran's actions and his circumstances, though. So, if he doesn't lie, just for an excuse, so he can do whatever he wants, say things behind my back that is completely wrong, try and boss me around as well, so I'm saying, careful, careful, or, you know, don't do that, or stop, you're not going to, well, you know, then... Yeah, if he wants me to be friends with him, then he's got to stop doing all that. Because I, I don't like it. Like, I don't like people making excuses so they can do whatever they want as well. Lying just for an excuse so I can want. But yeah, but yeah that's, that's how, if Kieran wants me to be friends with him, I just don't want him making excuses. Okay? So that's just what it is. Alright? Then, and then a couple of days later, I was... Mm, kind of being a bit of a nutter though, but then Ben all of a sudden just started overreacting. He should really learn to take jokes though, fam. He really should. But then all of a sudden, his mum heard what was going on. Didn't she? Didn't hear me, but she was hearing Ben overreacting. But then she started to phone me on Ben's messenger thing. So I answered the phone. Didn't say a word. She asked, "Are you there?" And I'm like, "Oh shit! Better hang up." Just hung up. Then all of a sudden, after that, she started to ring my parents or ring my dad, and and then tell my dad about what was going on and stuff. And then and then she all of a sudden, she threatened my dad. Not like not like death threat. You, you know what I mean. Not like death threat. You know, it's like saying, I'll tell you what this was about, yo. So she was saying to my dad, if you do not sort your son out or whatever, then I will I will get the police involved. And I was like, what? Why? You really don't have to take it serious. I, I honestly think she didn't have to take it so serious. And then all of a sudden, my dad started to get angry at me and, and all that. And then, and then, you know, he almost kicked me out of the house for it, though. And then Ben started to block me. Pfft, well, well, what? I don't, I don't know why. I, I honestly didn't even do anything. But seriously, Ben's parents and his family, you know, they don't have to really take it so serious. And as a matter of fact, they don't even understand about me. They don't understand about me, but now they now they start to understand about Kira and stuff. I really do not understand that shit. I really don't. I honestly think that's just not very helpful for a boy with autism. Yeah, well, they just don't know shit. Not saying it in a bad way, but they really don't know shit about me. Well, if they want to go ahead... And ask my dad and stuff, like what is your son like, and you know, then yeah, my dad will will just tell you. That's what he'll do. that's what he'll do. So yeah, and then all of us, and then, and then back in chapter two, season four. This is Fortnite now. I was like a completely oblivious with all the items in the shop. No, sorry. <laughs> I got it wrong. I can't speak. But yeah, I was completely oblivious with all the items in the battle pass because there was Iron Man, Groot, Mystique, Storm, She Hulk, Doctor Doom. Yeah, I was completely oblivious in that. I couldn't even wait. So I had to buy all the tears in one day. Completely. And Lewis and Russell saw me do it. Yeah, and then they looked at my level changed to 100. They were like, oh my god. Well, Alex as well. He was like, he was like that. I was like, he was like, oh my god. Yeah. And then, all of a sudden, Russell told, I didn't mind Russell doing it though, but Russell told Ben that I spent a lo a, all my tears. I spent it on all my tears. And then Ben said, it was a waste of your money. A waste of his money. But actually, it wasn't even a waste of my money. Because Ben didn't know shit about it, though. Because that was something that I, that I did on that season. I managed to get up to 220. And I unlocked the rainbow foils for all the tear skins. Like, I'm not, I'm not joking. Go ahead and, and type in on my channel, like search for the video, unlocking all the rainbow foils for all the characters. And you think I'm clickbaiting this? Well, I'm definitely not. So yeah, just go ahead, look on my channel and find it, or just search it on my channel. 
yeah. And then after that, after Ben had been saying that behind my back to Russell, I started to tell my dad the truth and what was going on and how did Ben's mum manage to um, get my dad's phone number. Okay, so Kieran's mum gave Ben's mum the phone number so she can threaten my dad. Well, that really got my dad well angry about it as well. And, and then, well, I showed my dad, like, what have I been gifting him? What I've, what I've been gifting Ben, though. That's him. Ben's him, you know. <laughs> and so I showed him. So I told him that I gifted him that Ben, the Captain America skin and the ninja skin... Okay, and then and then after that, my dad was thinking for a couple of minutes, and then he told me, "Stop gifting, okay, because it, it's your it's your money, it's no one else's." Which is actually a good point because it is my money as well; it's nobody else's. I wish I can still gift people, but now I can't. I just can't be trusted. I can't be trusted to buy anything on my account. Only my dad has control of buying on my account. So like on Xbox, on Fortnite, on PlayStation, on Amazon. Well, you know, I just can't be trusted. But the only way I can buy is just I can just use cash. I'll just give my dad the cash and then see if it's enough. And then he'll just buy it for me. Yeah, that's just how it's going to work. Even though I don't have that much cash now anyway. So yeah, and also... My dad thought I was spending over like £600, £600 as well, on gifting Ben and stuff. And because my dad was well angry about that, well, because the other night, yeah, my dad thought I was doing something, which I actually wasn't. He got so angry, he started mentioning about it as well, £600. And then he got well angry, he started to sell all my DVDs. For £600 on eBay. And I lost all my DVDs. Because of Ben. But. Do you want to know something though? Because I was speaking to Ben today. On Instagram. Because he has finally surrendered. Which is a good choice. The Q-Venture leader said. He was sorry about it though. He was sorry about my dad. Selling all my DVDs. And I do kind of appreciate that. Yes, definitely I appreciate that. And then all of a sudden, I just started getting carry, carrying away, just making more Qvenger videos saying like, Qvenger soldiers getting arrested, my soldiers killing the Qvengers. Yeah, I just, I just get carried away. But then, and then in the couple of days, this is quite true that Ben did say, it is not true that Alex and Lewis has been saying things behind my back. But actually, I think it is. But, you know, you, you, you have to prove it, though. Because Alex would tell me, what did Ben say? And, and Lewis would tell me what Ben did say anyway. But, yeah, this is quite true. I'm not, I'm not saying Ben is stupid, though. But, you know, he's just, he's just misunderstood all of this. Okay, completely misunderstood all of it and also and also um he said and he told me ben said he that it's not kieran's fault well actually it is kieran's fault because he made me start this anyway so basically it is kieran's fault because he's been telling me to try and piss off ben and stuff and ben said well ben told me i'm not stupid mark it was you that started all this not kieran but actually it wasn't my fault. So Ben's just blaming me for all this stuff. Blaming me for August 2020 stuff, you know. But I did I did tell him, I want to move on from the past. And he wants to move on from the past as well. So we have been talking as well. And, you know. So, yeah, Kieran does need to regret what he did was wrong. Because let me tell you something about him. So, if he doesn't regret... Or, you know, if he's like, if he doesn't say he's sorry for what he did, or is, it, it admit what he did was wrong. So, like, for, for example, if I said, I'm not going to admit what I did was wrong. I'm not going to say I'm sorry to you, okay? I'm not going to say that. 
yeah, then clearly that makes me a pussy. Because people who don't regret what they did is wrong, or, you know, admit, then they're just pussies. So Kieran's clearly a pussy. Because he won't regret what he did is wrong. He wouldn't say sorry to me for try and piss off Ben. Or, you know, he, he, he really needs to regret it. Regret it. I definitely think he should, though. And, also, if he wants me to be friends with him... Yeah, you know, like I said, and then... Right, anyway, so... <laughs> I can't speak. So, yeah, I kept thinking about August 2020, and then... And the one day before the new year of 2021, which it is right now, I just decided to block Kieran as well. And then... And then after the new year, Kieran found out that I blocked him as well. And then he was like... And then he wanted... And he wanted to um, me to unblock him as well. So basically, he was getting my sister to tell to tell me to unblock Kieran as well. But I I really didn't want to do it though. But you know, I I thought I'd give Kieran a chance though. But this is Kieran's one last chance. If he ever does shit that I don't like, or you know, say excuses so he can do whatever he wants, lies about me. So like I I said to him. If Ben's going to do this to you, then just go ahead and block him. And then Kieran said, I'll go ahead and block him tonight. But then, it was tonight. I looked on his friends list. And guess what? Ben was still on his friends list. See what I mean? He's a fucking liar. I don't understand why Kieran has to lie. I, I just don't get that. I clearly do not understand that. Seriously. So, yeah. One last chance. I'm giving Kieran one last chance. And then I block him forever. And people are going to ask me, can you unblock Kieran, please? Unblock him. Then, yeah, they can just keep asking me all over and over again. I'm just going to go, blah, 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 blah. Well, I'll probably give them a reason why I should keep Kieran blocked forever. But, you know, Kieran just wants to be friends, though. Kieran wants to be friends with me, though. So, yeah, this. So I've just got to make a choice. My dad, well, my dad. My parents don't even trust Kieran. I don't, well, well, my, my parents don't even like him anyway. And I don't trust Kieran as well. But I will be friends with him only on one condition. You know, like I said. Okay? And then... Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, I'm not wearing a top under here. Because I'm wearing, I'm wearing a jacket when I'm recording. Because you don't want to see my nipples and that. Pff, weird. Yeah, that's right. So, yeah, and then, yeah, me and Ben, I think we've just sorted all that out, but, but yeah, talking about but now, because the but is in the title, but he cannot talk to me that much, he has to be in a room where it's private, and no one can hear him and stuff, well, he has headphones, basically, so he could just go ahead on Instagram and block me, phone me, and then, and then we talk. And then, yeah, and when someone comes in the room, then Ben's just going to go ahead and go, oh, shit, I better end the call. And then, they, and then, yeah, they leave the room. He calls me back. And it's like, hey, how you doing? Yeah, you doing great? Yeah, we, we, ain't, we ain't even spoke for like five or six months now. Because, yeah, yeah, I've, I've, been, I've been saying to Ben, I think we really should move on, though. And we should forget about the past. Yeah, me and Ben should really re forget about the past, though. Okay? And I'm not sorry for what I did to him, though. I'm not... Well, I'm not sorry about the past anyway. Because I've got nothing to regret for. It's more like Kieran who has to regret it, though. So, definitely. And, yeah, Kieran has to learn not to boss me around. Because bossing someone around... So, like... I'm only 20, he's only 17, so bossing, so he's bossing me around, telling me, delete the videos, yeah, do this, do that, that's just completely wrong, clearly, clearly it's wrong, he can't tell me what to do, this is my channel as well, he doesn't have control of me, I'm not his dad, I'm not, well, sorry, <laughs> he's not my dad, I get mixed up with words, sorry, but yeah, he's not my boss, he's not my dad, He's not my guardian. He's none of... He's no one. Okay? 
Only my dad has control of me, okay? Not too much. So yeah, Kira needs to learn to not boss me around, including people who try and boss me around as well. Definitely they can't boss me around. And if people try and tell me, stop doing this, stop doing that, then you can't tell me what to do. I'm not even, I'm not even gonna listen to you guys. I ain't gonna listen. So like, you're gonna tell me to stop making more Missy videos, stop making more Fortnite videos. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead. I'm not gonna listen, I'm just gonna go, la, 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 la. okay? That's just what I'm gonna do. You, you know what I mean. So, yeah. And Ben also, he can't tell me what to do either. That's what he needs to know as well. But I think he now knows that scamming can be a criminal offence and it is against the law. Definitely a good point. It is against the law. So, yeah, definitely. This is all going to be forgotten in the past. And, yeah, Ben said to me, well, Ben asked me, can I... Well, I, I, well, actually, I asked him, shall I stop making more key vendor videos? But only if you, you know, then yeah. Because I, I can do that. I can do that for him. I could just stop making more key vendor videos. If Ben doesn't, you know, what, like what I said, you know, saying things behind my back or, you know, disrespect me, try and boss me around or just do anything. Well, do anything to piss me off. Yeah. So yeah, that, that's just the one condition. Just the one condition. I'm very glad that he has surrendered to my army, the Marcross Hunt as well. So yeah. So yeah, me and Ben do want to forget about the past. Okay? And I think we are good now. And yeah, but and Ben's family don't even have to trust me as well they don't have to trust me they don't have to like me i don't give a shit if they don't have to trust me and stuff but ben can ben can trust me but you know but some but something sometimes i can just be a nutter which i can be on my channel like saying like this person is using mods report him and hack him now yeah sometimes i just be a nutter because i am a nutter well basically I am the Joker. And people just need to learn to take jokes from me. And like I said, that depends on the subject and what it is. Okay? So, Ben just needs to learn and accept that I'm only joking with him, even though I don't really mean it to him. So, me, Lewis, and Russell, yeah, we, we're just joking around with him. And that's what we do. So Ben can, can tell his parents that um, they don't have to trust me, but but he trusts me, but Ben trusts me, and you know, and Ben's gonna have to tell his parents that I've stopped making more Q vendor videos now. So yeah, so that's what that's what I want though. That's what I want to do, and I told him. If I wanted to be a man, then I have to do something in life. But in life, there is no happiness. Because you work, you make money, and you pay the bills. That's definitely no happiness. But I've got to do something to make me happy, you know? Just play some video games, just have a laugh and mess around. Or, you know, just pretending to be a person like... Michael Jackson, well, I can't really do the impression of Michael Jackson because I'm just mocking him, which clearly makes me a nutter. <laughs> yeah. So, no one bosses me around, like I said. I'll make a choice of my own, whether I want to stop making more videos of Fortnite or GTA. Yeah. it's I'm, I have control of my account on YouTube, not you. You are not the boss. And you're not the controller of me. So that's what it is. So. Anyways guys. If you did like this video. Give this a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. I'll see you guys next time. So have a great day and night. Peace out.